Welcome back everyone. I hope you all doing well. We're looking at new anomalies I discovered today at a site in Terra Serenum or Serenum. I'm not sure how you pronounce it. Let's have a look at the original photograph then I'll show you the anomalies. The high-rise team calls this photograph possible chloride salts in Icaria Fosse region. Acquired on the 13th of June 2009 at 25.3 centimeters per pixel with one by one binning. I'll be showing images cropped from a JP2 black and white map projected file. It's huge folks, comes over one gigabyte in size. Took me quite a while to find these anomalies. And there's a look at the low res black and white. Check out that weird terrain. So the site's right here folks, at approximately 43 degrees, 59 minutes south, 125 degrees, 35 minutes west. So to start off with, we're looking at that strange, almost teardrop or plectrum shaped object. It's about 8 meters long and it's got a strange small disc in its center. I'd say that's about a meter and a half to two meters in diameter. Got a nice shape to it, nice symmetrically placed there in the center. And we're looking at the object over there to the top right, coming in at about five meters across. And I'm not sure what this is folks, could that be a hole? With this light material sticking out of it? Or is there something casting a shadow? We're seeing nice rounded holes or maybe shadows in those folks. Right, up next we're looking at uh, some straight lines, parallel lines in that piece. It's about 10 to 12 meters long. Check out the uniformity in the thickness of the straight pieces yeah, and uh, we've got sort of right angle stood over there as well not sure what to make of this piece folks looks like there is something lying against the one side of here but it continues through underneath and over here not sure what this is. The piece is lying over the... Is that a dune? Let me know in the comments below folks. I don't know what to make of that piece. Check this out. And then up next. It's a rather odd piece about 12 meters long. It's got this very thin well-defined edge to that part in the center parallel with this one side and it looks like it's also partially hollowed or carved out and then there's another piece over here it looks like this a long narrow part slightly rounded this curvature to it is inside this are very bright it looks different to the surrounding piece and then uh, let's end it off with this odd shape it's about 12 meters long check this out and uh, that slot looks almost like a fossilized fish head not that it is folks but that's a rather strange part Hold on to the seat belts, folks. We're shooting down to that site in Terra Serenum. There's the photograph we analyzed possible chloride salts in Icaria Fosse region. And there's a look at the anomalies just briefly again. Let's have a look at some of the other anomalies at sites surrounding that one so this is way down to the southeast 
possible structures spotted in Raga. Made a 3D illustration of this one. Got some layers to it. Then that slant with what looks like an opening. Something a jar. Could that be a door? Who knows, eh? And then a bit more to the southeast. I featured these pretty recently as well. Nice shell dome shape there. Check out that. Looks like a ridge bevel on that piece. Yin yang. Very strange. And uh, a mini sort of Stonehenge type anomaly there. Let's see what else we have around here. This is near the Amos 3 lander. Some more oddities in the center of larger ones. Okay, I need to do reduxes of these using Gigapixel AI as well. One last site north of Clark. Three small items in a row there, folks, spaced evenly apart. What's all these long narrow parts with uniform thickness on Mars as well? This looks like paneling or sheet metal. Rather odd. And this reoccurring phenomena on Mars. These smaller objects in the centers of larger ones, are they in holes? Are these hatches or are these casting shadows? Could be both. We need a closer look, especially side views, those will help a lot. As always, thank you for watching. Take care, everybody. Stay tuned for more Mars anomalies. I'm looking for new stuff every day. I just haven't found something for the past couple of weeks. Nothing new is showing up. And also the sun was blocking uh, the signals from Mars. So we weren't receiving any photographic updates from the rovers or the MRO. But those are slowly coming in again. Maybe I'll find something new in those. I hope you enjoyed the game that I've done in the meantime while I had nothing else to do. They do contain anomalies. The game is about anomalies. Now I've got a nice top-down view for you guys with the flying uh, objects or sources in the game. So yeah, do take care everybody. I'll see you soon. Ciao for now.